Take a deep breath. Ah. Ah. I feel good. Just have a great performance, good energy. You know? Yeah, it took a lot of time and effort to get here, so enjoy it. Here we go. Enjoy it. Café! This is KEXP. It's 90.3 FM in Seattle, worldwide on the web. KEXP.org. My name is Chili. I have the pleasure of welcoming welcoming back Las Cafeteras. Welcome. Let's hear some music, please. This first jam right here dedicated to dreamers and undocumented folks all over the world. Here we go. Tiempos de amor. Yo nací de la tierra, tengo el mismo color Yo nací, yo nací Nací de mi madre, yo nací de la flor Yo nací de la tierra, tengo el mismo color This next song goes out to the Duwamish and to all the indigenous peoples all across the world, to everyone who's being pushed off their land. This land is your land 
inmigrante. Live here at KEXP, joining us from Los Angeles, California. Welcome back, Las Cafeteras. You sound great today. Thank you. Looks it's like you're feeling here. great, too. <laughs> Welcome to our new home. Glad to have you guys back. New album this year called Tastes Like L.A. Yes, it does. And I would agree, yes. It's, <laughs> it's a mix of languages, of cultures, of styles and sounds. Tell me a little bit about the new record. Snap. You know, a lot of times people ask us, what do y'all sound like? And we say, we don't know. <laughs> and so we have to tell people, you know, we sound like we're from L.A. You know, like if you go to L.A., there's a smell, there's a taste, there's a sound, and it's a mix, and it's not one thing. And so for us, that's kind of what, what it is. You know, we say we taste like we're from Los Angeles. And so when you listen to our album, you get to a lot of different flavors. And even on the cover of our album, we have an ice cream truck because, you know, it's like L.A. culture. You know, that's that love, it's the like street vending, it's that smell of the tacos, you know, it's, it's all that jazz. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. What he said. Yeah. I mean, you know, the record, it's, it's, it's also like our different influences, you know, like Denise, how Denise grew up is different than how I grew up, than Leah, than Hector, than Jorge, who grew, who grew up in Chiapas, Mexico, than Gloria, who grew up in Boyle Heights. So I think it's also like it's us putting all of our influences in this this pot of songs and seeing what what happened. I think that's LA is that we're, even amongst Latinos, it's very diverse, you know? What we listen to, what we eat, what we sound like. And we took a leap. The last album, It's Time, had a lot of Son Jarocho, um, which is sort of how Las Cafeteras started with the music of Son Jarocho. So we tried to expand and, and get a little crazy yeah, with man. it. Yeah. It works well and it suits you. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. And you have a few new members in the group since last time. Yes, they're super cute. 
and they're joining us. Um, so Leah, maybe Leah, if you could share I'm what just new. happened. <laughs> Leah just had a baby, yeah. you know? You can't tell right now. So our newest member is Ella. She's not in the studio right now. Her ears are just baby ears. Um, but <laughs> she's with us now. Congratulations. Thank you. She's adorable. She and looks just like her dad. Super like her dad. <laughs> and then we also have Jorge Mijangos, uh, straight from the motherland of Chiapas, Mexico, right here. Uh, and so he's playing Renquito. He's actually a, a maestro of ours. He, mm. he actually is a luthier. He actually made my instruments. He made Daniel's instrument. He made wow. Denise's instruments. Uh, so he's, he's a ladero, man. And uh, it's, we're super honored and lucky to have Mijangos with us. Um, and we also have Gloria Estrada, who's a beast, <laughs> you know, on the bass. You know, vegetarian beast. And uh, yeah, she's a vegetarian beast. And so Gloria also has uh, a bunch of projects she's with. Um, she has Viento Callejero, which is a cumbia project in LA. She's part of Finger Dancers, which is a jazz project in LA. So definitely check those out. And so for us to have Gloria uh, and Mijangos, like they're monster instrumentalists. And so it's an honor to have them join us while Leah uh, took a step back from maternity leave. And our brother David went to UCLA to get his PhD. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Congratulations. So speaking of, of the new album taking a leap forward and incorporating some more sounds, is is there more of a progression to come? I, the, the heart of the group is still there, but you're expanding. Do you see that coming in the future as well? Yeah, I think, I mean, I, when we go to rehearsal, I think it's a little out of control because... <laughs> so many ideas. <laughs> there's so many of us, and we all kind of put our contributions in each song, or we try to, and that's why we ended up with Trabajadora, because we just couldn't finish it. It's like a 10 minute song, and we just couldn't like make it any smaller because everyone wanted to contribute to it. Um, so I think, yeah, there's, there's so many of us all coming from different experiences, different musical influences, and we all, we all wanna put that sound into the pot of sounds. Yeah, I think also this this last album was a really cool sort of. Um, it was nice to sort of pass that that test because our first album was was what we had been doing for so much time before that, um, and then it was it was like a live recording, live sort of studio thing. Um, the It's Time album, and then this next one was was really different in the sense in, in the way that we composed the songs and the way that we recorded them, and so it just really opened up a, a lot of sort of possibilities in terms of like what we can do from here on. Um, just having that under our belt. So it's, I mean, I think the future is really wide open in terms of what the next Cafeteras album is going to sound like, but it's it, it's in the works. <laughs> it's really cool because you guys are exposing uh, a new generation to traditional sounds and then at the same time pushing the sounds forward and, and starting a movement with people and getting people interested in revolution and party at the same time and fusing cultures old and new together. It's really amazing to see. I mean, I think you brought it up. I, I, part of our whole thing is like, you know, it, it's easy to complain about what's wrong in the world, and there's there's all, all kinds of place to do that, you know, to say what's wrong, and we need to name that, but I think what one of the things we try to push ourselves to do is to to name what we want, what what's the positive thing we want to put out there, and so at the end of the day, part of it is bringing people together to dance and, like, celebrate and be together. Even if you disagree, you don't have to be on the same page to dance together, you know, and maybe from that we can be a little bit more human, a little more open and then maybe have a, a conversation about the future of our neighborhood or family or country, you know, wherever you're at, but. I'm with it. <laughs> this is Las Cafeteras live here at KEXP. Shall we celebrate a little more? Yeah. I'd love to hear a few more tracks. If I was president, here we go. Mm.
leaves as I face the congregation. First thing I do is free education. And every third period, we practice meditation. Every third period, we practice meditation like a brown Robin Hood. I take from the rich and give to the poor. So my little sister ain't gotta be hungry no more. Nah, man. But you know what? My first lady would be my mom. Cause she'd smack me in the head if I was dropping bombs and I free my poor black and brown. I feel my poor black and brown that got caught up in three strikes And when they get out, they get the free bike So they can ride to the future Cause the last shall be first and first shall be last So everybody sing like we were at mass Me gusta la lima, me gusta limón Pero no me gusta tanta corrupción Me gusta la lima, me gusta limón Pero no me gusta tanta corrupción Song is dedicated to all our working people. It's a working people song. Here we go.
house of miles of feet. Time is really running thick. Can you fit a breakfast in? Lucky if you see your kids deeper, take this moment in. Out the door and on your way. Up you go another day. Got to be on point today and update that resume. Cause this recession is a test. They're making cuts and now they want more for less. So if you start to feel that extra stress, just do your best. And leave the rest. Cause our ancestors did it too. Somehow they all made it through. Today, Las Cafeteras would like to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. To our mothers who sacrificed to make ends meet. Hey. Thank you. And our fathers who faithfully take care of their seeds. Thank you. Now the farm workers, the food you harvest keeps us alive. Thank you. And our teachers training their students to excel and survive. Thank you. They get to new word auto, they old star war on you. They get to new word auto, nega, nega run you. Don't you know no word auto, don't you know no word auto, don't you know no word auto, nay. Shanghai, these are from cooks, waiters, and bakers for our daily bread. The TAs, assistants, and those teaching special ed. Bus drivers getting us to work on time. From DJs, breakers, fighters, and MCs who rhyme. Students with two jobs heading those books at night. And the organizers bringing us together to fight from the little ones doing their chores and homework. Cafeteras, if you're feeling grateful right now, say yeah. Yeah. If you're feeling good about being a KEXP, say yeah. Yeah. If it's been a long tour, say yeah. Oh, hell yeah. And if sometimes, after all the work you put into every rehearsal, every piece of work you do to show up on time, running, going around to take care of your family, your kids, your neighbors, your friends, rehearsing every line. You just want someone to walk up to you at the end of the tour and say thank you. Say yeah! Put your hard working hands up. Hey, put your hard working hands up. All right, put your hard working hands up and put them side to side with Thank you. Gracias. Thank you so much. Las Cafeteras is live here at KEXP. Two albums. It's time and the latest from this year, Tastes Like L.A. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for stopping by and playing music for us today. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Happy to See be you here. soon. You're very welcome. Las Cafeteras. Chili. KEXP Seattle. El sonido. You guys take you out to Sloppy Joe's?
No, nobody takes me out oh. anywhere. That's a travesty. <laughs> TMI. Anyone TMI. out there TMI. willing yeah, to take right. me somewhere? <laughs> I know. I saw you last night. We're vegetarian <laughs> now, so they'd have to be yeah, vegetarian. Okay. They'd have to be vegetarian Joe. I think he could do a sloppy vegetarian Joe. Yeah, <laughs> Vegan Joe. I, I know that Joe, and I don't want to have him anymore. <laughs> oh. yeah, I'll take you out. Oh. We'll go to Burger King. Discover new music at listener-powered kexp.org.